Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have some information about Rolex, the Rolex brand that you guys need to know about. You guys need to pay attention to what I have to say about Rolex today. It is very, very important that you hear this information. But before I pass along this information about Rolex and the brand, let's go into my magical intro. Hello guys, so I'm back. And today we're gonna to talk about the Rolex brand, like I told you. Big things are happening with the ADs at this moment. At this moment, big, big things are happening with the ADs. ADs are finally calling up all these customers that they've been in a waiting list for some years. But you know why they're doing this? Okay, I'll tell you why. The reason now that the ADs are calling all these customers have been in a waiting list is because the watch market, like I told you in my last video, is dead. And the AD's number one customer, I repeat, and the AD's number one customer were the gray watch market dealers. And the gray watch market dealers ain't buying right now from the AD's. You might be thinking, that the ADs were selling these watches to the great uh, watch market dealers at MSRP. No, they were not. They were selling them. In other words, an example, if if they had a, um, a Submariner, uh, 41 millimeter, green bezel, black dial, the watch cost, let's say an example, let's round it up to $9,000. I don't know, $9,000, $10,000. The authorized dealer was selling it to the gray watch market dealers at probably $14,000, $15,000. That's right, you heard that right. $14,000, $15,000. But the funny thing is that ADs, they get, when they get those watches from Rolex, they get a 40% discount on the watch as it is already. In other words, if the watch, if the watch costs $10,000 and they get a 40% off that, you know, uh, $10,000, the watch is costing the AD $6,000. So they're, they're double dipping. They're making money from the Rolex brand at the AD store, and they're selling at the back door, back door to the gray watch market, you know? They go through the back door and they sell it. They sell them Daytonas. They sell them Submariners. They sell them GMTs. Guys, ADs are also gray watch market dealers. That's right. You heard that right. ADs are also watch market dealers or gray watch market dealers, whatever you want to call it. And this is what's happening. So what's happening now is the more popular the watch, the higher the price from the AD to the great watch dealers. In other words, how many times have you heard of somebody buying a Rolex yellow gold Daytona with a green dial from an AD? It's very, very rare. It does happen. It does happen. But it's very, very rare. Who gets them all? The gray watch market dealers. They get them all. They didn't pay MSRP for it. They didn't pay $37,600 for the watch. No, 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 no. That watch, they had to pay for that watch from the AD. They had to pay for that watch probably in, you know, in, in, the, in the high 50s, mid 60s. That's right. So ADs now don't have those dealers, those watch it, those watch market grade dealers coming and buy for them now. They, they don't, they don't want to be stuck with these watches. You know, they don't want to be stuck with them. I'm not saying that every a AD dealer does this. I'm not saying that every AD dealer does this, but a big percentage of them, they're also into the gray watch market. 
That's right. ADs are also great watch market dealers. Only their back door, you know, back door, back door, you know, back door, the back door. So now I have people that are calling me up, telling me, you know, I just got a phone call from my AD. Really? Yes, I, I got my watch that I wanted. Another one called me up. Uh, I just got a phone call from my, my AD. I, I can't believe this, you know, out of nowhere. So my advice to all of you out there that you have been on a waiting list, run to your ADs and let them know you're alive still and you still want to watch. Because Rolex now, all these ADs are letting watches go, letting watches go. So go to your ADs, don't forget, go to your ADs and let them know, let them know you're still alive and you still want to watch. But this is what's going on. The gray watch market is no longer buying watches from the ADs in the back door because they don't want to be stuck with it because the watch market is dead. The watch market is dead. Don't let them keep on telling you that it's not out there. The watch market is dead. Rolex watches, you're gonna be able to buy them at retail price, MSRP. That's right. You're gonna be able to buy them at that price. But you gotta go back to your dealers. Don't call them up, don't call them up. Go there in person and let them know that you've been waiting for this watch so long, what's going on? Watches are appearing everywhere, in the United States, in Europe, in the Caribbean, wherever, they're appearing everywhere because the secondary gray watch market ain't buying no more watches back door from the ADs because they don't want to be stuck with them. Watches are dropping every day, dropping. Watches are just dead dead commodity so again I'm telling you what's really happening with Rolex ADs in the way they operate I am not saying that every AD is that way no 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 but of a hundred percent of the ADs I'm telling you like around a 60% are doing that selling backdoor Rolex watches to the gray market dealers but it ain't happening no more because the gray market dealers ain't buying them no more because they don't want to be stuck with them i just got offered a root beer a rolex rose gold root beer brand new for forty three thousand dollars brand new for forty three thousand dollars it's dead the watch market is dead so those of you that really want a Rolex watch, it's your moment to run to your AD and let them know, and let them know that you're still interested in getting that watch. I really hope you learn something from this Rolex ADs to backdoor selling to the gray watch market. That's right, they go through the back door give it to the gray watch market but they ain't buying no more why would they give it to the gray watch market because again they were not selling it to the gray market in an MSRP price no they were selling it to them if the watch cost ten thousand fifteen thousand dollars the more the demand of the watch the higher the price platinum Daytona let's say an example cost ninety thousand dollars eighty thousand dollars you got to pay the the AD 130 that's right. Well, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video and you learned something from this video and run to your AD, ASAP. I'm telling you, run to your, AP, to your AD. Run, quickly. So, guys, I hope you really learned something from this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like my video. And remember, gentlemen, take care and brush your hair. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the secondary gray watch market is dead in a backyard pool. And that backyard pool right there, 